Emily. Welcome back to Emily's Paper Caper. This is where you'll find inspiration to scrap your stash. So if you haven't already, punch that subscribe button and let's get scrapping. Remember last time I shared with you the big stack of 12 by 12 white paper I was trying to use up in my stash. This time I'm showing you three more layouts with white backgrounds. This time I'm dressing them up with Dilutions Spray Ink. Take a look at this. Here's a peek at the first layout about my birthday this year. Here's how I created it. I'm using a six by six template and or stencil and two colors of Dilutions ink sprays, kind of a red and a yellow. And I'm moving that template back and forth on the page to make sure I get total coverage and then I'm giving it a quick dry with my heat embossing tool. I always start with my photos in mind, and so I had already picked a, a matte page paper for the large 5x7 photo. The matte wasn't big enough, so I cut it into two large triangles and then made it fit again on the back of that 5x7. I also used parts of that matte that were going to be hidden by the photo to matte the Hooray for Birthdays words that serve as the title. Um, hooray for birthdays was left over from a pocket card. And here's some close-up looks of the finished layout. This was a lot of fun. It reminds me of the fun I had celebrating with family but also at work. Now let's look at the second layout. This is a swimming layout um, which is always fun. I love pool layouts. To create the background I used a new Gina K Designs template stencil called Making Waves and my favorite Dilutions ink color London Blue ink spray. I gave the page a dry after I sprayed that background and then I dug deep into the stash. I've had these square creative memory stickers in my stash for a long time and I decided that the yellow would be complementary to the blue background so I put letter stickers on each of the um, squares, yellow squares, to make the title, which is Jump In. And here's a couple close-ups of the page. I really like those yellow stickers to uh, create some motion. And the last layout is from Harp Gathering, so I used a music stencil to create the background here. And um, I always try to extend um, and get the most out of my scraps and mats. And so I'm using part of this yellow scrap um, to mount the stickers that serve as a title on the page. Then I'm tucking the yellow back behind and you almost can't tell that I cut anything out of it. But I, I like how this one turned out, the strong photo of my sister and daughter in the lower left is my favorite. There you have it. Three more layouts all done. I hope you're ready to get inky with some Dilution Spray Ink. If you haven't already, subscribe and please leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks. Bye.